As Bear County Sheriff Javier Salazar moves into his second term in office, we have a clearer picture of the massive overhaul in personnel that took place during his first four years in charge. Records obtained by our defenders show Sheriff Salazar dismissed more than 100 deputies. As Dylan Collier reports, a vast majority of them stayed terminated. <laughs> specifically inside the jail where you're giving drugs to from deputies involved in drug smuggling schemes to others arrested for domestic violence bear county sheriff javier salazar's first term in office ran the gamut as far as discipline cases are concerned agency records show salazar fired 102 deputies between the start of 2017 and the end of last year remarkably only five were reinstated out of that small group only two still work for BCSO. I'd rather work a, a man short than work with the wrong with the wrong man. Salazar's strong approach to discipline has caused critics to say that he rushes to punish deputies and puts the county on the hook for significant back pay if these employees are ever reinstated. But the data does not back up that claim. County records show during Salazar's first term, the county paid out less than $4,700 in back pay. It was given to a single detention deputy who was fired, then reinstated in 2019. I've made no secret of the fact that, that we've got people employed here that probably should never have been hired. Some of them probably should have been fired years ago. Salazar said he's taken the proactive approach of having internal affairs build cases that can stand on their own and prove wrongdoing even if a criminal case against a deputy falls apart. If something needs to get done, as distasteful it is, get it done. And so that's what we do in every one of these cases. For the Defender, Stilling Collier, KSAT 12 News. The 102 dismissals do not count deputies who resigned in lieu of being terminated by BCSO.